What's good, everybody? How y'all doing? Y'all doing all right? I hope you're having a shit one. It's your boy Hobbs, and we got a brand new video for you guys today. Now, look, in this video, we will be watching South Park Season 1, Episode 3. If you haven't seen my other South Park videos, I'm going to leave a playlist down in the, in the description for you to go and check those out as well. We react to South Park all the time over here on this channel, so go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you're new. Comment down below what other videos, shows, whatever. Whatever you want me to react to, leave it in the comments and I might just get to that thing ASAP for you guys. Let's get right into this right here. South Park episode 3 of season 1. Weight gain 4,000. Weight gain 4,000. Let's go. Hey Stan, did you see that rainbow this morning? Yeah, it was huge. Uh, I hate those things. Nobody hates rainbows. Yeah, what's there to hate about rainbows? Well, really? you know, <laughs> you'll just be sitting there, minding your own business, and they'll come marching in and crawl up your leg and start biting the inside of your ass, and you'll be A rainbow? Hey, get out of my ass, you stupid rainbows! Yo, what is this nigga on? Carmen, what the hell are you talking about? I'm talking about <laughs> rainbows. I hate those friggin' things. Rainbows are those little arches of color that show up during a rainstorm. Oh, rainbows. Oh, yeah, I like those. those are what did he cute. think he said? What were you talking about? Huh? Oh, nothing. Forget it. No. What marches in, <laughs> crawls up your leg, nothing. and bites the inside of your ass. Nothing. Children, children, remember the Save Our Fragile Planet Bro. essay contest that you children worked so hard on last month? One of our very own South Park students has won the national prize. Mmm. Wow. I Token. knew I would win. Gosh, Mr. Garrison, this sure is exciting. That's right, Mr. Hatt. The winner on the of the wall. National Save Our Fragile Planet contest is Eric Cartman. What? How Eric win? Congratulations, wins. Eric, on writing the award-winning <laughs> paper. Kick Ain't no way. Ass. That's impossible. Cartman doesn't right. grow rainforest from a pop tart. Yeah, That's what I'm saying. Pop tarts are frosted. Out of over a million <laughs> papers, Eric's was chosen as the grand prize winner. Wow. What did you write about, Cartman? Uh, you know. This and that. He doesn't even know what he wrote about. <laughs> that nigga plagiarized that shit. <laughs> My paper was on the suffering of bottlenose dolphins. Well, you see, mm. you shouldn't have written a paper about dolphins. Dolphins are stupid. Dude, dolphins are like the second smartest animal on the planet. Well, Yo, what is uh, Carmen right? on? If they're so damn smart, how come they get caught in those fishing nets all the time? What? <laughs> wait, wait, there's more. It says here that Eric's trophy will be presented to him by... Kathy Lee Gifford? Kathy Lee is coming to South Park? And the presentation Kathy will be Lee? on national television. Television? National Kathy television? I don't believe it. Kathy Lee Gifford Yo, in South Park. That's oh huge. Oh my god. This that's is our huge. chance to make a name for ourselves. To show that we're not just some pissant white bread mountain town. Better yet, it's a chance <laughs> for you to get some publicity. Yes. If I can show just how much I've turned South Park around, I could become a senator. Maybe even a state senator. Mayor, we should decorate the town square. Then we should have the chef of the school cafeteria sing a song and play up the ethnic diversity of our town. That's right. He's a black guy, you isn't he? Black is the Wait, they want a chef to sing a song and not the choir of the school? Did I hear that correctly? And and they want him to sing because he black? I mean, we all know black people talented. Let's not get it twisted. But, like, just because he black? Night itself, what is that? Mayor. What is that? Like, kind of get some diversity? Show the diversity of the town? Is that what you're trying to do here? Senator, Mayor. We should decorate the town square. Then we should have the chef of the school cafeteria sing a song and play up the ethnic diversity of our town. Oh. That's right. He's a black guy, isn't he? Oh, black is the brother. night itself, Mayor. Yes. <laughs> we can have the children of South Park Make put a on a little play. black as the night itself. Kathy Lee loves children. If they're working in a sweatshop, that is. Oh. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> hey, guys. Bro, what? what's up with this, After bro? I'm on television, I'm going to be totally famous. Hitler Yo, was famous Cartman too. Is going Hello on there, children. Hey, hey chef. chef. How are my little crackers today? Good. Did y'all hear about <laughs> the news? Kathleen Gifford is coming to South Park. Yeah, because Cartman cheated and won the environmental essay contest. I, yeah, yeah, I, I knew well. it. But the mayor I knew just he called cheated. and asked me 
to sing at the ceremony. Wow, are you gonna do it? Of course. Of course. Kathleen is a beautiful, sultry queen of sexual fantasy. And if I sing oh. to her, maybe I can lure her into a night of exotic delectation. Hey, what you yeah, trying to get into? Cool. <laughs> nah, I, see, I feel well, go ahead and get your shit Frank give us anyway. <laughs> oh, I can't even concentrate on writing <laughs> papers with all this excitement. Why are you looking at me like that, Mr. Hat? Have you forgotten about all the pain and suffering this that guy. Kathy Lee Gifford caused you? M Mr. Hat, that, that was a long time ago, and, and I was only a child. We could have won that talent show. We could have been huge. huge. Knock, knock, Mr. Hat. Who's there? Orange. Orange who? Orange you glad I didn't say banana. Nigga, what? Thank you. Wow, Mr. Hat. Looks like we might win. And now, our last talent show finalist, Kathy Lee Epstein. That's her? If they could see me now, that little guy of mine. I'm eating fancy chow and drinking fancy wine. I'd like to stumble bumps to save her if that the kind of top job first rate chums I attract. All I can say is, wow, well, we look where I am. Tonight I landed, pal, right in a pot of jam. I said, I'm holy cow. They never believe it if my friends could see me now. Yo. That's how she got famous? It wasn't fair. <laughs> she had choreography. How could we compete with that? But now she's coming to South Park, and I know a way to make it all better. How? Hell no. <gasps> no, mister. His hey, eyes are going through his head. Kill Kathy Lee Gifford. No. John, as you all know, no way he pulls Kathy that off. Lee Gifford will be in South Park to present the award to some kid for an essay. No way he pulls it off. Whatever. Now, I'm going to have you luscious little youngsters do a play about the history of South Park. That'll be wonderful, won't it, Mr. Hat? Kill her! Mr. Hat! Mr. Oh. Garrison, <coughs> I'm asking you to direct our little play. Oh, that's perfect. You see, Mr. Hat, we don't have to kill her. We can just upstage her. Mrs. Mayor, you might want to review the essays. We think Cartman might have cheated. Who cares? Now, kids, what <laughs> exactly say at we this give point, it? like, come on now. At this point, y'all already got Kathy Newman coming to South Park. I mean, like, come on, bro. Come on, who care if he cheated? He did what he had to do to get the, you know what I'm saying, to bring in the publicity. He already done did the ding. ding. So let it be, man. You know what I'm saying? Let it be. Now, what y'all gonna do when she get there, though? That's the real problem. What y'all gonna do when she get there, right? Because y'all can't fumble the bag. This is a whole bag in front of y'all face. Don't let the bag get fumbled, all right? Come on now. Come with it. Execute now. Execute. It's all about execution at the end of the day. Our South Park best. Mm-hmm. And who's South our Park little best. prize winner again? Me. Hey, Connie. How about we get in shape, huh? We want to look our best for the TV cameras, don't <laughs> no, we? No, she didn't. <laughs> How about we get in shape? She don't look the best either. She didn't get her we don't her mind in shape. That you won that contest fairly, fat boy. Oh. Stop defending your little girlfriend for writing about some stupid fish. Dude, dolphins are intelligent and friendly. <laughs> stupid fish. Intelligent friendly fish. on rye bread with some mayonnaise. Dolphins are way smarter than you. If they're so smart, why do they live in igloos? Dolphins don't live in igloos. Oh That's God. Eskimos. Dolphins, Eskimos, who cares? It's all a bunch of tree-hugging hippie crap. Tell me what you wrote about. <laughs> I can't. I have to go home and get in shape. Yeah, right. <laughs> he can't. You'll go and sit he in front didn't of the write it. and eat cheesy poofs, ass master. Screw you, hippie. <laughs> we'll be right back cheesy to poops. Jesus and Pals after this. Hey, you need to get in shape fast? Want to look your best? Tired of the other guys getting all the chicks? Are you tired of being a 90-pound weakling? Yeah, I only weigh 90 pounds. Then bulk up quick with weight gain for the <laughs> of saturated fat per serving, its patented formula is designed to enter the mouth and go directly to the stomach where it is distributed to the bloodstream. Now available at stores everywhere. Get some today and say it with me. Beefcake. 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 May cause irreversible damage to the kidneys and liver. Mom, can you get me some weight gain for 
That's how they get you. Okay, Eric. <laughs> I'll get you some at the store tomorrow. That's how they get you, man. But tomorrow is grocery day, Eric. Bro, this nigga always crying like a little bitch. I'll be going to the store now, then. <laughs> and his mom responds in exactly the way he wants her to. Look at this guy. Kill nightmares. Her. No, Mr. Hat. I won't do it. Kill. <laughs> that does it. You're going in the dresser drawer, Mr. Hat. She'll make a fool of you again. Well, you can just stay in that drawer, <laughs> Negative Nancy. Nah, that's hey, facts, Gage? though. Like, they, the I don't feel like he's gonna pull that Haven't shit off. you notice the three feet of snow on the ground? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I have a nice body, and I wanna show it off. You got that? What? You've got to weigh 90 pounds. I'm up to 94, thank you very much. What? Yeah, they're almost as big as his mom's. <laughs> <laughs> that's all you want. I'm the one who's gonna be on TV looking all buff. What's that stuff? That's true. Weight gain 4,000. It's helping me bulk up. Bulk up to what? Fat ass? Super fat ass? <laughs> hey, I don't have to take that kind of crap when you're scrawny weakling. Nah, they on your <laughs> shit, boy. Sweet. Check me out. Look at this crack Look showing. Kind of can't even get the door. <laughs> Come on, people. We've got to turn this place around. Hang up the lights. String up the banners. Castrate the cows. Castrate well, the Mr. cows. Garrison. How is the little play going? Huh? Oh, fine. We were just about to run it from the top. Oh, please do. I'm dying to see it. <laughs> okay, all the little pioneers right. on this side of the stage. Let's get this shit right now. Good. And all the little Indians go to the center of the stage. Right. Am I an Indian or a pioneer? Do you have a feather on your head? Yes. Then you're an Indian. Oh. <laughs> okay, baby. This is your line. <laughs> this Bay -bay. is the story of South Park. It begins over a hundred years ago when the noble and hardy Oot Indians lived on the land. Okay, okay, let's we'll see what we got here. Oh, don't they look adorable. Then, uh -huh. from the east, came the great white pioneers. Oh! <laughs> Seemed pretty oh accurate God. to me. They did it a lot better this morning. <laughs> they had more energy. The pioneers <laughs> met with the Indians and negotiated hey. for their fertile He's land. Bleeding. Mr. Garrison, oh. we cannot have our children beating each other senseless in front of Kathy Lee Gifford. Well, what do you want? This is how it happened in those That's days. That's what I'm saying. It, it seemed accurate to me. Mr. Garrison, <laughs> this is not appropriate. Do you actually think that Kathy... Bro, why are you so Lee Lee Gifford would enjoy this? To hell with Kathy Lee Gifford. Oh my God! What have I said? He said oh. to hell with Kathy Lee Gifford. Oh yeah, because he wants to kill her. Mr. Garrison, I am dismissing you from directing our play. Look at him, bro. Already fucking up the bag, bro. It happened again, didn't it? Now we do things my way. I can't kill her, Mr. Hat. You're bro. gonna have to do it. Ah oh, shit. <laughs> All right. Somebody get this psychopath out of here, bro. Whoa, Carmen. <laughs> <laughs> about wide load. Yeah. Damn. You're really starting to fill out nicely. You're not filling out nicely. You're fatter than ever. I'm not fat. I'm getting in shape. Carmen, you're such a fat ass that when you walk down the street, people go, God damn it, that's a big fat ass. <laughs> no, no, no. You jealous wiggling. God damn, that's a big fat ass. Uh, uh, Hi, <laughs> that's oh, a child. No, another hippie. Peace, Wendy. Shut up, Carmen. Oh. Two little hippies sitting in a tree. What she said? Can I help you? Ooh, yes. He gonna I do need it a gun. Like that? Would this be for hunting, home protection, or other? Other. Alrighty then. May I suggest a strap for twelve millimeter? Okay, try it on. Yo, what? That looks really nice on you. The lacquered black really matches your eyes. Look you at talking this guy. to me? You talking to me? I don't know. It's a little small. Okay, uh, how about small. this? You talking to me? Mm, no, I don't like this one either. Here's the same gun with a wood finish. You talking to me? I don't see anybody else around here, so you must be talking to me. The fuck? I'll take it. Hello? Yo. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> 
that that gun with the wood finish, it did the trick. If dolphins are so smart. <laughs> My essay by Eric Cartman. When I wrote the following pages, or rather the bulk of them, I lived alone in the woods on the shore of. Oh. Girl. Well, Mr. Hat. Oh, shit. I guess old Kathy Lee really will be surprised when she gets here tomorrow. She beat us in the talent show all those years ago. And I think we owe her for that. <gasps> ba bang You... Bro, he should have put a silencer on it, man. You think he put a silencer on the sniper? It's not even a sniper. Howdy, Mr. Garrison. That's he good. don't care. He finna, he finna mow down. That's he finna good, mow down. Mr. Garrison. <laughs> Thanks. Hello, Officer Bar Brady. Nice gun. Thanks. Is there somewhere <laughs> in town where I can get a good, clear shot or a view of Kathy Lee? Hmm. You know, I think the book depository would be a good nah, bet. Nah, that's crazy. No, that's crazy. Yes, that might do quite nicely. Thank you, Officer Bar Brady. No problem. He gave him ah, the murder you red site. No pictures of Kathy Lee. Where is she? <laughs> Yo, what? This is sweet. Camera crews are setting up, and I'm looking totally whipped. Beefcake. Oh my God, God, Cartman. I don't think they're gonna be able to get all of you in frame, Cartman. Bro, you, you really let yourself him. go. Stop oh my who? goodness. Mr. Garrison, he's going to try to kill Kathy Lee Gifford. Oh no, you yeah, don't. She heard everything. You're not gonna ruin my moment of fame. He's got a gun. <laughs> you gotta get over this whole jealousy thing. All right, kiss it. Just face it. I wrote a better paper than you. It just so happens that I have your paper, and I know why you want. <laughs> There's something more important right now. Let's go. Wendy, you've got to prioritize. What's more important, being on TV or some stupid assassination? Stan, I can't do it alone. Please. Ooh. She's trying uh -oh, to. Oh, we're losing him. Here she, she comes. To... She know what she's doing. <laughs> no, no, she in a glass bubble. Damn, I guess I'm not the only person in America who's thought of killing Kathy Lee Gifford. We love you, <laughs> Kathy Lee! <laughs> we love you, too. Come on, you little bitch. <laughs> You've got to come out of your precious bubble sooner or later, Missy. It is with mm. great pride and honor that I'd like to welcome Mrs. Kathy Lee Gifford to South Park. And now, our very own her. South Park Elementary Chef will sing a special song in honor of Mrs. Lee Gifford. Thank, Thank you, Mr. Mr. Mayor. You know, Kathy Lee, he you are show his a ass. very special woman. He I don't mean special his in a Mary Tyler Moore way or, or special in an extra value meal at Happy Burger way. I already hear no, the music. No, 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 no. I mean special. <laughs> like the song of a, the hummingbird as it gets ready to find that female hummingbird Bro. and make sweet love to it all night long. Just two hummingbirds moaning and, oh, and groaning, brother. letting their bodies caress and touch each other in ecstasy. <laughs> oh, like Kathy Lee, how I'd love to lay you down and lick every inch of your body with my tongue. What? Kathy Lee, you're my <laughs> sexual fantasy. What? How Yo! You and me. Uh, uh, thank you, <laughs> Chef, for that heartwarming song. Oh my goodness, Love. get him thank out of you, here. Oh, oh. <laughs> God bless you, Kathy Lee. Officer Bar Brady, Mr. Garrison is about to kill Kathy Shoot Lee. Shoot a shoot, man. <laughs> what? You mean the teacher? Wait a minute. Is there somewhere in town where I can get a good, clear shot or view of Kathy Lee? Hmm. You know, I think the book depository would be a good bet. I think the book depository would be a good bet. Book depository. Depository. Book depository. Book depository. <laughs> Damn, he could be anywhere. I'll yep. send out an APB. No we way he just up. said that. And now, he's in plain here sight. Present the award for the environmental essay to our own Eric Cobb. You know what? He better get the fucking shot, too. He better, he better bullseye that shit because he is lining that hoe up. For the perfect assassination, and he better get it done too. Man, he better get it done. God damn it. Is your favorite celebrity and mine, Kathy Lee Gifford? Damn, they put her up there in the bubble. Thank you. I love you all. Mr. Garrison, 
Stop! <laughs> Leave us. We must finish what we have begun. I know no. that she's hurt you. She's hurt a lot of people. You can't know. You should have won that talent show. It is with a great honor and pride that I present the winner this trophy. Eric, would you please come up here? Here it is. My <laughs> big moment of fame. Eric, and then she finished it all on, by buddy. throwing her voice with two dummies at once. I know that, Mr. Garrison, but this isn't the answer. It is too late for me, young Wendy. <laughs> you see, I've learned something today. You can't win all the time. And if you don't win, you certainly can't hold it against the person who did, because that's the only way you ever really lose. You, you're right. Good. Man. Did she really throw her voice with two dummies at once? The bitch must die! <laughs> Good lord. Oh! Kitty! Oh my god! They killed Kitty! You Bro, bastard! Bro, what the fuck? Man. They killed that nigga like four, five times last episode! And y'all still killing my nigga? What did Kenny do to y'all, huh? <laughs> what y'all got against Kenny, huh? What y'all got against Kenny? What, that don't make no sense. Who was Kenny to y'all, man, huh? Who was Kenny to y'all? Like, seriously. Do y'all y'all just hate Kenny? Did y'all make Kenny just for him to die in every episode, nigga? Hmm? Is there ever going to be an episode where Kenny doesn't die? Like, be just be straight up with me right now. Come on, like, let me know. Because I get shocked every fucking time it happens. And he doesn't just die. The nigga dies gruesomely. Okay? This man just got his head split open through a damn pole. He got shot in the head and then split, got his, oh my goodness. God! Hey! Go back! I don't make no we didn't even sense. get to do our play! That I guess that's it, no guys. Wrap sense. it up. Hey! Wait a minute! And this Neither nigga to be then TV. broke the damn stage. It, kid. No Kathy Lee, no public interest. But I win environmental essay contest. You don't deserve to win, Cartman, and you know it. I'm holding Cartman's award-winning paper. It's actually nothing more than Walden has. with Henry David Thoreau's name crossed out and Cartman's name written in its place. Who cares? Yeah, right. Kathy Lee Gifford's gone. Right. What about not holding anything against the person who wins? Right. Well, not if it's Cartman. Bitch. Hey, where are you all going? They don't even know what Walden is. I bet if Walden was a sitcom, you'd all know what it was. Come on, Wendy. <laughs> Kyle's mom will make us tuna fish sandwiches. Ah, uh, what the hell? Tuna fish sandwiches no, sound pretty good. No, Now I'll be stuck in this podunk town forever with all these stupid, hick, redneck, jobless, truck-driving idiots. Uh, Mary, the mic is on. I'm about to say you well, right you in front of that room. With it, eh, Mr. Hat? Well, I would have gotten away with it if it weren't for those meddling kids. You're lucky you missed Kathy Lee Gifford and that nobody got hurt. Kid. We hope you can come back to school real soon, Mr. Garrison. Well, children, I'd love to, but the doctors say that Mr. Hat needs more therapy. We can still get her. <clears throat> I'm just so sorry that I ruined everyone's chances for being on TV. Oh, Not Cartman. My he gets to goodness. be on TV anyway. Really? How? On what? Obesity. Adiposity. Corpulence. Whatever word you use, it represents one thing. Being a big fat ass. We have with us today, live via satellite, Eric Cartman from South Park, who is now so obese, he can't even get out of his house. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. You know what? You, it, this right here, this right here, is ridiculous like it, it was already ridiculous but this right here doesn't actually make sense like it actually does is that his ass on your air is there anything you'd like to say to people out there follow your dreams you can reach your goals i'm living proof Nigga, what attack. he needs to run his ass around the block a few times I'm surprised he, wait, he got her? Loving, chef. Damn, woman. I just gave you sweet loving five minutes ago. Were you trying to kill me? 
<laughs> yeah, well, that's how it be, nigga. No, nah, that's dead ass how it be, bro. Look, 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 look. If y'all want to see this, if y'all want to see season, I mean, if y'all want to see the next episode, episode four, <laughs> go ahead and hit the like button, man. Let's see if this video get. Let's see if it get fifty likes. I'm gonna drop the next episode immediately. Okay, as soon as it hits fifty likes, it'll drop. Guarantee, okay? So hit the like button, man. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. South Park is a crazy-ass show, but I love it, okay? I love it, so I'm going to keep watching it. 50 likes, next episode. Comment down below what other videos you want me to react to as well. I'm going to get to them things ASAP for you guys. I'm out here to put the city on my back. Don't give me the key to that because I might overreact. I'm out here to put the story in the rap. If they don't beef, I would be back, but Check I might overreact. Look. Look at me running again, geeked up with a motherfucking pen. Look at them talking their neck, worry about me instead of a check. 